What's going on, Raider Nation? Big Tuna here with you. And uh, before we get into the news here of this most recent transaction by the Raiders, I want to first and foremost thank you for watching. Second of all, while watching, remember to like the video, subscribe to our channel, and comment below on your thoughts of this transaction. Um, also, be on the lookout for new material. The Raider season is coming up quick, um, so we're excited for it, and we're going to be ready for it. Um, also, be on the lookout for videos of the uh, Big Tuna Gets Real uh, about the addiction stuff. That should be coming out in the next week or so, episode two of that. And also, like I said, any late-breaking Raider news and sports news, stuff like that, we'll be here. We always are. So, the Raiders have been very thin at linebacker, with injuries to Nick Morrow, Coons got hurt, and, you know, they, they released Aaron Lee. The Raiders need to go out and get somebody. And instead of signing K.J. Wright, they made a trade here for Denzel Perryman, a former second-round pick of the Chargers. Um, he was the 48th overall pick, I believe. Um, you know, the Raiders traded the sixth-round pick of 2022 to the Panthers for a seventh-round pick and Denzel Perriman, linebacker. Now, he is a middle linebacker, um, and he, I mean, he's a veteran guy. He knows what he's doing. Um, you know, he's not a big name or anything like that, but he's a solid starter. Um, he played for the Chargers. He's played for the Panthers. Um, and, you know, honestly and truly, it, it, we're so thin at linebacker, anything can help. But the big thing is, is that Gus Bradley coached this guy. So I'm guessing Gus Bradley had some input here on the guy that he wanted to bring in for his defense. Now, him starting a middle linebacker, you know, with Morrow, looks like Morrow's injury is going to be worse than better. And, you know, with Littleton... Witowski, Tanner Muse, um, and with Jevin White being out, you know, it's just, it's it's going to be, you know, linebacker by committee. And it sucks, but, you know, this is what happens in the NFL. People get hurt, and things happen. Unfortunately for us, the Raiders, the linebackers didn't look half bad, especially with Morrow re-signing. Um, and with White looking better and Muse looking better after having an injury plagued rookie season, you know, I was excited. But now we've got Moore on the bench, Jevin White on the bench, uh, you know, Darren Lee was released. Um, you know, now we got Kwiatkowski, Littleton, Richardson, Tanner Muse, and then Denzel Perriman. And I don't know if Perriman's going to actually start, but if he's, you know, better at middle linebacker, it makes me think that someone's going to be the odd man out here. And I'm guessing it's going to be, well, it might not be Tanner Muse. I mean, you got to think about it. Who's going to be the odd man out here? You know, is it going to be Littleton? Is it going to be Kwiatkowski? I really didn't think Kwiatkowski would be the odd man out, but he might be. Um, you know, who's going to get the yellow dot or the uh, green dot as well? Who's going to be that guy to call the defense? Now, if he's played with Gus Bradley before, he probably knows Gus's defense. And, you know, why not have a guy like that that already knows the defense and spend time with the defensive coordinator? You know, it's, it's, it's going to be very interesting to see who starts week one at linebacker. If it was me, I would like to see... You know, I'd like to see Littleton. I'd like to see Kwiatkowski out there. I'd like to see Perriman out there. I just, Muse is just still a little too raw for me. But then again, who knows? Maybe Muse is just killing it. I mean, they get a sack in preseason week one. I don't know. But overall, we're thin at linebacker. I knew they weren't going to try to go after K.J. Wright. The right decision was to go out there and trade for somebody that wasn't going to be too expensive. And the best thing is, they got a guy that knows the defense. And, you know, we'll take it. And, like I said, we're so thin at linebacker, anybody will help. So, we'll see what happens. But it's going to be very interesting to see who week one 
starting linebackers are because I think a lot of people are thinking it's going to be, you know, Littleton, Muse, and possibly Perriman over Kwiatkowski, and I, I, I don't think so. I think Kwiatkowski is going to end up playing. I, I thought he was our best linebacker last year, but we'll, we'll see what happens because it's going to be very interesting with Gus Bradley in there, and you know, John Gruden's going to let Gus do what he does and. If this guy here, Perriman, knows what he's talking about and can call that defense right, you got to put him in there. I mean, the defense was so bad last year, you got to get improvement at every position, especially at linebacker, too, because we were torched running the ball and, and covering tight ends, and that's what linebackers do. They, they protect the run, and they have to cover the tight ends, and we did not do good against that, you know, especially with, you know, Travis Kelsey being in our division, as long as Noah Fant, and now Jared Cook is a fucking charger. So, you know, it's going to be interesting, but, you know, we'll take it. We'll take it. We'll bring in some veteran leadership there. Well, not leadership, but we'll bring in some veteran presence there at linebacker instead of going out for a high-priced guy like K.J. Wright. So we'll see what happens, but, you know, I want to see your thoughts there in the comments below. That's all we're going to talk about today. Like I said, thank you guys for watching. Do me a favor while you're watching. Hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button. Comment below on your thoughts of this uh, trade. And uh, like I said, be on the lookout for any late-breaking Raider news. And uh, episode two of Big Tuna Gets Real, My Life with Addiction, will be coming out relatively soon. So we'll see you guys soon. Stay safe. Stay humble. And as always, let's go Raiders.